If I show you the following JavaScript syntax and ask whether this line of code will throw an error or not, most of us might get confused at first. The correct answer here is that this line will work without any errors and it's quite simple to understand how. In JavaScript, almost everything is treated as an object, even primitive data types like strings have object wrappers using which we can access the properties and methods of the string class. To understand this line of code better, we can break it into two different lines. So in the first line here, we'll declare a variable by the name of str which stores string value and in the second line we'll access the length property of the string variable which will return the value 6 since we can also access the object properties by sending the property name within square brackets so if i write str square brackets and within it pass the string length we'll be able to access the same length property and the first line here worked because we condensed these two different lines within a single line subscribe to the channel for more such videos